Thank you so much for watching Tomohisa music. That was interesting. I had a you know disc in this camera, but I think I erase every time you know after I record it and 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 it empty. But I, you know uh, I started the video and it didn't work. So anyway, so I got a package from Zotario. <laughs> I already opened this because you know um, card failure but anyway um, I'm gonna do unboxing Here's unboxing right yes and then I'm gonna demonstrate something okay nice okay yeah so um, I have I have something special, so I'm I'm going to open. I I don't know what exactly is, but um, yeah. But uh, so unboxing, I always have to do this, you know. Just don't look and toss it. Thank you. I'm sure somebody waiting for that. Yeah, so. Oh, so this ball. Oh, wow. And open it. Wow, look at that. X S. What do you think inside? X S. Wow. Nice. Nice packaging, you know. Yeah. Then, whoa, how you do this? Oh, okay. Ah. Is this way to open it? Wow. Well, something stuck. Supposedly. Oh yeah, okay. Look, look at this. It's really. Oh wow. I see. So like, I see, I see. See, like, can you can you see that? Like, really nice, and strings. I think they moved, but that's good. Oh, I see, I see. Supposedly, like this. Oh. See, supposedly, it's showing you like. I messed up a little bit. Sorry about that. Oh, like this. Probably. Yeah, it just shifted inside, you know. Nice. Picks. Yeah. And then, really nice leather. The dear player. So several years ago, I posted a simple question to our team of engineers and product designers. Can Dodario create the world's greatest coding strings? Bar none. Wow. Yeah. Amazing technology. Yeah. So you wanna you wanna you wanna uh, look at you know, a uh, video that they have on a Dodario website. I think that's much better than I explained from this, you know. Yes. Wow. So, um, one thing I, I read about that quoting um, part is, um, you know, from website. It's really thin. Um, so thin that more than 10 times thinner than um, human hair my hair that's amazing 10 times thinner yeah wow
Okay, there is no noticeably less acoustic damping normally associated with other corded strings. I know some people really liked you know cording strings because um, no no noise, but but this one, I think tone is good, feels good, right? I have to check it out. All right, so now, so here's the strings. Okay, yeah, never fade away. I like that. You know, like, oops, this way is better. Yeah, wow, 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 wow. Nice package, nice, nice package. This is how you open it? Okay, I see. Yeah, exciting. Smooth feel. Maximum life. Yeah. So this is um yeah, tens to forty six. How you open this one? This is it. Oh I see. Ah. Wow. Sorry, I just you know, I just I just open first, so, you know, so I'm just reading stuff yeah and this cool I see that open you know easy to open uh -huh. Of course, really hard to see it, but it's a so you know sixth and the fifth string, and then let's see. Okay, yeah, yep. So you can tell, you know, fourth and the third string, and uh, second and the first string. So you know, I'm gonna change slowly. Maybe I should do maybe I'll put, put here so I understand. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, this is ni this is nice packaging, Delario. Thank you so much. This is very special. Yeah, and, uh, <laughs> I think I, I'm just messing up like opening this box. Here. Sorry about that. Yeah. And then you know, string color and white. But I have you know, just a regular one first. You know, so yeah. Okay. So uh, so like I'm I'm using three thirty five. Okay. Oh, I should have brought um, something white. But anyway, so I'm, I'm going to do, you know, really s simple way to do it. Um, like, like I use a lot of Strat, you know, Diosonic. Those definitely I wipe, you know, um, each frets, you know. But um, today, let's do simple way. So like, e you know, each... I would do like this a 335 because you don't want to change all the strings because this you know stay like that. So I would do like you know maybe just change you know two strings each. So this case I'm just sixth string and a fifth string. Okay. All right. So that's all the string here on this side. Yeah. Just to make sure. Yeah. This is really heavy frets, right? Yeah, this is a 1967 um, Gibson ES335. I bought this when I was 17 with a delivery newspaper. Oh, I see. So, uh, gold one, it's, um, uh, you know, thicker strings, so six strings. I think that's how we do it, right? I hope not. Oh, no, no, no. You know, maybe I'm doing it wrong. 
Anyway, let's figure it out. So this is this is definitely six string. Maybe they do it a different way. Ah, I see. I have to read. <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah. Let me see. No more six string. All right. What they do? All right. So now here, let me do this. So you see, like this type, right? So maybe like you know two post. About about the two posts, you know, and just roll back, and then I just use my finger. See, this is kind of vintage, so you know I don't want to use um, t uh, what do you call? T um, I can I can I can find the words. See, this is a vintage tuner, so really uh, delicate, you know, so I don't want to use uh, I can't find the word. Yeah, I don't want to use this one to, you know, go too much. Wow. So, so you see? see yeah at least like two times two times you know so I would do like this yeah I think it Best way just you know take take each string like that. Okay, I want to see this also. I just don't want to mess up. Is this right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I'm sure. Right. Okay, just in case, you know. So the fifth fifth string right now. I thought they just mix up something, but no, no, that was my imagination. So same way, okay. Almost like you know, um, you do like a two post going back. So that way, I have enough turn. I don't know why. Give it, give it some type. I I kind of want to do it like this by hand, especially in you know, old or old tuning peg. Uh, those um, I don't know. It's plastic or um, it's a you know. I don't want to break. Okay, I can't see. So first time you go above the string. The second time below the string, and then kind of pinch. Take your time. Take your time. I hope you're clean. See? I think I did not not so good. <laughs> Alright. I thought I thought, you know. This is good because 335 I don't play it that much and so it's nice to have a you know strings that last a long time and especially see like this it, it's little it takes time you know and already it's it's smooth but it's not um, too slippery 
it's it's good it's nice and smooth Also, nice and tight. Nice feel, nice feel. Wow, that's great, great. Yeah. So you see, like, already, sorry about take your time. You know, nice and smooth. So let's do the one string each. Why not? Okay, so now next one is a third string, a fourth and third, right? Yeah, so each one, let's do each one. Simple. Perfect timing, perfect timing. Because tomorrow I'm, I'm using this uh, guitar to record. Um, guitar wisdom uh, lesson videos I'm going to George's house tomorrow Sunday today's uh, Saturday okay so now I'm playing uh, fourth string now the same same way about you know about you know not exactly about but two posts uh, just going back hold the string Sorry, I, I wish I can show you a little bit more. But first time, so above, above, above the string, okay? And just, you know, hold it tight. And the second time, underneath the string, okay? So the kind of pinch. And at least uh, under, tw twice or three times I, I rolled, you know? So why not? Just about right. Yeah, I don't know. Gibson type, I just want to do by hand. Yeah, by hand, you know, not using that thing. This. <laughs> See? Then. You don't have to, you know, worry about this, but just... Oh yeah. Wow, this is nice. Beautiful. I look forward to play it. Great, great. So now, third string. Okay. Very nice. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, just be careful with strings. Oh, see? Oh. <laughs> I said careful. I said careful, but I almost say, you know. Um, see, like when you cut the string, if it's too short, if you hit it, you know, you, you poke your finger, you know, so. Be careful. Very, very careful. Wow, I see, I see. So even like um, plain string has really thin cord. So like, yeah, like almost like, a, you know, after you do shampoo, you know, you put the conditioner. Then if you put the conditioner, and put a little uh, water, and you make really like a smooth, right? Like, like a, almost like a conditioner on the strings. Wow, nice. Wow, okay. Zeta. I'm so spoiled now. Man. Yeah, the Dario is amazing. Always comes up new technology and, you know, new idea. You know, really nice. I mean, those, the pedal board. I was just using really simple uh, shingle, shingle pedal board and uh, you know, you can't really 
change the size you make small or big you know and always I have about four or five pedals that's about it maybe four now, I like the limitation I love the limitation because that makes me do something better usually you know so but that just need one more then you know extend and also slant it a little bit more like this so easy to push it and that tuner are really good really good the tuner very accurate and really easy to see and sizes are small that's very nice <laughs> okay that's fine okay so now this let's see this go yes okay so I have to really concentrate this part Yeah, very important, you know, details. Nice. I show you when I finish it. Yep. It's nice. It's nice. I mean, I have to change the strings anyway. So, like, you know, demonstrate this. Some some people probably understand something they didn't know. Which is really nice. Nice. Wow, yeah, sm sm pretty smooth. That's actually, that's good. Very nice. Beautiful. Wow. Yes, that's uh, really nice. So now I'm going to change two strings same time because save some time. Okay, so don't don't repeat the you know um, mistake. So you so you, when you cut the string, don't cut too too short. You know, because y y you might hit string. So like here. Yeah. Okay, so here. Okay, three. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So this guitar I bought when I was seventeen and already I had three thirty five. Which one is? I believe this yeah. So, I already had new Gibson ES-335 I bought, and, and both, you know, I did, I did by, you know, working the uh, news, you know, newspaper del delivery, you know. Anyway, I bought a new one, and I, I played about a year or so. And I felt like really stiff, you know, the guitar was a little bit stiff. Now, now you know, now it's vintage, but, you know. Um, but then I saw um, this guitar at the music store one day. And I still remember it's all original, you know. And the tuner was really beat up, you know. I had to change. And, um, but everything original. 
And so something about the vintage guitar, back, I didn't know about the difference back then, but something about the tone, really soft, but at the same time, really crisp. And any notes I play, it rings really, really nice. I don't, I don't know what it is. So I had to s s uh, trade in that old, not <laughs> my first real new Gibson guitar in 1982. I believe that's probably around 82. And then I bought this 1976. Seven, not the seven, 67. So, so <laughs> I'm gonna go. 67, you know, and a little bit expensive, but I had to do it. So I probably I told you before, I brought this guitar home with original case that really beat up, especially um, the handle was broken and somebody put new, you know, you know different handle. My mother was not the furious, but just she was really saying, why you sold a new guitar and buying old guitar and you pay more money? That's what she said. Uh, I was just, you know, I don't know, I wasn't really sure how to explain that one. But now my mom said nice things to me sometimes. You're a professional, so you should buy really good guitar. You know, the other day we were talking, you know, FaceTime kind of thing, okay, Skype. And she said that. That's very nice. Very sweet. Because I always sh show her, you know, my, my father, what guitar <laughs> I like. I'm going to tune up later, okay, so I will do this part. Yeah. Thank you so much for watching this patiently. Maybe I should have a music, music, you know, or something. But why not? Almost we in the same room, right? So the first string I will do like a little bit longer. So I want to go a little bit more, you know, times, at least four times. Oops. I would say Gibson guitar is a little bit difficult to uh, put, you know, change the strings. Um, th this one, you know, stop tail pierce is a little bit easier if you change, you know, a few strings, you know, each time. But uh, uh, it's a stop tail pierce. The other one, you know, like um, in Japanese we call bran branco. <laughs> so. Um, yeah, that other one is a little difficult to do. I have to use a capo, you know, put the strings in and I hold with a capo, then I put the string, you know, tied up. I will show you, that. that's a really nice trick too. Okay. Almost, almost, almost. Wow. Wow, nice and clear. That's good, 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 good. Yeah. I see. Yeah. See, like, generally, you know, I don't like traditional uh, coating strings just because I'm so used to regular strings and I use resistance in everything, you know, character of strings to understand what I'm doing. So I use regular string. I mean, lately I'm using EXL 
110, which is a normal one. Good quality, you know. And I change strings more often, so I use that one. And then, um, yeah, sounds really crisp. And I understand if I press too hard, I can hear the noise. So noise is great way to you know hear my technique. So if traditional quoting string, uh, if I use, I may comfortable to press a little harder. That's why I afraid to use that you know. But now this one, it's I can feel it's it's the same. I still feel like you know re resistance from the string. You see, you hear that squeak noise, which is good. You don't want to go too silky, wah wah sound, you know. <laughs> Dadari, you did a good job, amazing. Yeah, I know what you mean. Banan. Banan. Yeah, I, you see, that's what I'm trying to do when I'm teach, teach, teach guitar is really difficult to do. Not just showing things, but also really understand each other, each other, for me, other person's personality. So really have to, you know, bring myself to that person's um, feeling, you know. Otherwise, hey, learn this one. I don't, I don't push people. I just um, give them opportunity to understand something I understood. And it was difficult to understand. I mean, <laughs> tuning stability, you know, really, I'm just tuned up by ear. Wow. I'm definitely a little bit smooth, you know, the feel, but still, I have that, yeah, regular. F I'm just enjoying. I think I, I lost a lot of people again, you know, because I'm a little, a little too long. But why not? YouTube is free, you know, so uh, why not? <laughs> yeah. Wow, this is this is awesome. Yeah, so. Kind of hard to see, huh? Okay, I'm gonna clip the strings first, you know. Yeah, definitely away, <laughs> just in case, away from your face, you know, when you cut. I like I like use this you know kind of clipper. Nice, very precise. 
Yeah. This string cutter, cutter by a big boy, made in Japan, really cut nice. So um, once again, this this is my this is one. Maybe this lighting is too much. Yeah, yeah. See, you can see the ring. It's a bit be really beautiful, right? About uh, maybe this way. No. Oh. oh, oh. So hard to do. Yeah, this. I'm not sure you can see. <laughs> All right, that's it. That's it. That's it. I just move it. Over. really right on that. Close enough. Yeah. Yeah, stay in tune nice. Nice and smooth, yeah. It's really amazing, even, you know, uh, top strings is corded. Excellent, excellent. Thank you so much, Dario, and everybody. Thank you so much for watching Tomoku's the music. So that's how I change strings very carefully, and you know, each string or two strings at one time. It's a little bit different from Stratocaster or Telecaster. Uh, you know, a Fender type is kind of easy because you take all strings, you put it back again, especially hard tail. Yeah, but this type of guitar, you know, has a has a I say bridge moves you know whole thing so that's the part is you don't want to move so you can't change whole thing then everything move right so two two strings at a time this is beautiful guitar yeah i love this guitar the color is so nice right you know yes okay thank you so much and um I really appreciate it. Also, also last video uh, well, I made, um, the art of chromatic scale, which is not the scale to teach, but just the simple things to understand how to play slowly, to be patient, and then, you know, um, no noise, and you can work on the both hand muting, in a posture, and concentration, everything. And, you know, Took me a long time to explain whole whole thing, so ended up I, I I made like you know thirty more than thirty minutes. So, but that video is doing really well. 
and seems like helping a lot of people a lot mentally and physically which is really great um, thank you okay so please subscribe Tomokushita music here and um, please share with your friends that'd be great so I look forward to make more video thank you so much all right so see you soon take care bye